Hey everyone, this is a bit of a different video for you guys. Uh, I am Nathaniel Robojance. This is Nintendo Prime. You are not at the wrong channel. Uh, what you are seeing or are going to see at least for the next 15 minutes uh, are essentially gameplay for a new game that's going to be unveiled at E3. Uh, this game is coming to Steam and home consoles, including Nintendo Switch, uh, in 2022 and the game is called Moolander. Now there is a campaign mode and what you're primarily going to see in here are 15 minutes of the campaign mode but it also has a, a really cool multiplayer. Unfortunately the multiplayer mode is only available in a local setting right now. There is a playable demo on the Steam page. I do ha happen to have a special demo that enables when more multiplayer modes. The, the problem of course things. being that I don't really have anyone locally to play with. Uh, this is E3 time. My children are gone uh, and uh, my fiance has gone on a bachelor Shoot. party so it's just me. So I'm doing the best I can here to kind of show off this game. Big shout out to the team behind Moolander uh, known as The Sixth Hammer. Uh, they were founded in 2011 and they have grown ever since working hard on all kinds of software solutions so they could fund their passion in games. Moolander's official start of development was in 2017 and the game itself was by design for desktop PCs. We took part of the Plovdiv startup weekend event and that's where they made their first ever playable prototype. They continue to work on a bigger one that we presented at the Game Dev Summit, or they presented I should say. We got a lot of good feedback, uh, they got a lot of good feedback and that got us super motivated. In the following year they expanded the team with members from Colombia, Romania and Canada. They got an office in Plovdiv and joined one more programmer. Uh, and the next year the team acquired more people in Bulgaria, USA and Hong Kong. Uh, so yeah. Yeah, and obviously this video is a sponsored video. This game will be featured during E3, and if you go down to the description, there actually will be a link to the E3 booth page. Now, if you have signed up uh, to attend E3 in a virtual cap uh, capacity, either through the website or uh, in their application, it'll be open tomorrow. So tomorrow you'll be able to go check out their virtual booth for Moolander. And a big shout out to the Six Hammer for deciding to... Uh, you know, sponsor this video and, and maybe, you know, get a little bit more attention on their new indie game. All right, so let's get into this a little bit. Uh, so they sent me this stuff to kind of go over quick. So we're going to go over uh, this. It says, you know, greetings, fellow gamers for this year's E3 online booth conference and the first big appearance of Moonlander at this event. We have prepared something special for you. An expanded multiplayer build with additional arenas and cow for you to play with against your friends. Again, I'm not going to be showing off that mode, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, you, if you have friends locally, you'll be able to enjoy it. First of all, thank you for accepting the call and helping us bring our awesome game to your own audiences. And thank you guys for that. Uh, they went on to explain a little bit about what Moonlander is. Here it is in short. Moonlander is a 2D adventure platformer with Metroidvania elements featuring an epic story about cows, milk, and ancient civilizations. And again, Moonlander 2022. They have a longer description here. We're just going to go over this. Uh, it says, milk, the purest energy source rivaled by the brightest hypernovas has been lost after the war scour the unknown in search for the source of infinite milk with the last interstellar spaceship of your kind fight with intelligent and diverse life forms unlock unique tactile and combat abilities in the emotional six plus hour long campaign full of memorable characters and plot twists tame the mighty cow bosses master your skills to match the superior intellect of our advanced cow AI. Discover beautiful yet lethal handcrafted landscapes with their unique challenges, enemies, puzzles, trying to save your dying civilization. Continue fighting in PvP and PvE multiplayer as a mighty cow or a high-tech lander with up to four friends and have fun in brutal combat and cow chases. And again, I won't be showing off any of the multiplayer here. Uh, this is just me playing through the demo that you can go download for free on Steam right now. Just look up Moolander on Steam. I'll put a link actually directly to the Steam page as well down in the description if you want to go try this for yourselves. Now, I am playing this with mouse and keyboard. It does note uh, that it's best played with a gamepad. Unfortunately, I, I wasn't able to get any of my controllers working with the game. I don't know if that's an issue with this demo or maybe it's just an issue with me and my I copy of Steam. I haven't used a controller on PC in quite some time. I tried using the Xbox Series X controller and then a couple other generic controllers I had. But again, that could just be an issue on my end. 
Uh, so mouse and keyboard controls are, are fine. You know, use WASD to move around. Um, e to deploy a shield once you unlock that ability. I to go into your inventory and change out some things. Tab uh, switches between weapons and, and different stuff like that in the game. And use your mouse to kind of aim uh, and shoot stuff and, and all that. So it's it's fairly basic, at least the controls, but it does take a little bit of getting used to. I think uh, left shift, I believe, is eventually you'll see in this video, like a little boost you can get. Uh, it. I'll, I'll say one, let's just start with the, the visuals. This is definitely a visually stunning game uh i really really like the look of it now the music uh, doesn't change a whole lot in this demo so i was playing this demo for about 45 minutes and i did kind of get a little tired of the looping music but uh that's just because i really suck at this game and i'm not playing it with a controller where i feel like it's it, if a game says it's designed for a gamepad uh that the mouse and keyboard controls are clearly going to be a bit rough uh and i found that to be the case uh, but again, if you've got a gamepad working perfectly with Steam, I don't right now. Steam's not even recognizing any of my controllers at the moment. Uh, this will probably be much easier for you to enjoy. I did play in ultra settings. I did only play it at 1080p just for sake of recording. Uh, but yeah, I really hope that you guys uh, enjoy this. I'm just going to kind of shut up now and let the game speak for itself for about the next, you know, nine minutes or so. Uh, so hey, enjoy a fresh look at Moolander, a preview of a game appearing at E3 2021. Hamilton! <laughs> this tree has hands! It is not a tree, sir. It is a vine. Whatever! You know that hands freak me out! We found our guns. I am initiating reattaching protocols. But please be careful, sir. They are very powerful. <laughs> yeah, I know.
Here she is, Hamilton. What a coincidence. <laughs> I'm ready to fight. Turn up the battle track. Be gentle, sir. sluggish bombs. And on top of that, I can only drop them vertically. Sir, this is our most powerful non-lethal weapon. Just keep dropping the bombs on the cow. Mm. Mm. 